you to be in a position where you feel that you don't have the support because there are, you know, hundreds, if not thousands of people that support and want to hear your message, but we just do not want you to be um, damaged by having to deal with how it would have been handled. Yeah. Yeah, I appreciate that. I mean, I've been tagged in some videos and I've gone and watched them and I've made my own opinion off that quite, quite quickly. And, um, you know, I, I just um quite shocked at what I've been tagged in as well, um, which obviously just goes to show, you know, um, and I don't know people, you know, like I've said, and I, I want to keep saying numbers don't matter to me, you know, it's the humanity, it's the unity, it's a safe space, it's the moral compass, um, it's that, that safe space within someone's moral compass. Moral compass speaks more to me than any numbers ever will. Yeah, 100%. And it's your story, do you know what I mean? It's, you should be able to narrate your exactly. own story. Like, and you should be able to do it without being told you're wrong. Yeah, I mean, I'll give you an example of numbers right from the beginning. This has been an issue, which is why I say this. I actually met Bev through quite a big crate on here. Um, Bev, I need to point out straight away, morally did not agree when she's heard, you know, my side of it and what's went on. Um, Bev actually showed me respect to come to me to ask me my side. And when I told her and I showed her the proofs, um, she very much came and stood united with myself. That was quite a big creator that, you know, and someone who promotes against DV, and it was a lady as well, it was a woman. She actually two years ago did videos um, invalidating my trauma, saying I'd entrapped them using, you know, what she didn't promote out was a holy god app. She actually made people aware that that was entrapment. And instead of making awareness that there's holy god apps and, you know, mm -hmm. things that you can do to get evidence, because that what you know, keep keep yourself safe in those situations, yeah. she jumped on and she defended my perpetrator. And that was on a big account. So I have actually That was here about on that TikTok, creator. wasn't it? It was, yeah. And yeah, she's got I remember quite a big that. account. And sadly, two weeks, two or three weeks after she did that to me, she did she did actually suffer um, at the hands of a perpetrator herself quite publicly. And I do feel for her for that. Um, but, you know, and she used the tools that I used at that time that she actually slandered me for and invalidated to actually safeguard herself. So I thought that came full circle. But I have, I have put an olive leaf out to her. Um, you know, and I did think, you know, a woman to woman off the app we could then resolve that because I did actually just speak about her and validating us um, in my therapy as well. Um, and Bev did, you know, she came to us respectfully and asked us what went on there. Um, so for me, it's not about numbers, it's about moral compass, um, you know, and, and getting awareness and education and getting safeguarding skills out there uh, in unity. You know, yeah, I, I'm, and that's I'm exactly not the only survivor about. out there. Mm hmm. That's exactly what it's all about, and that's, you know, what we want to do too. Mm -hmm. I, um, I'll jump down now so you can have a chat, um, but thank you so much for letting us up uh, for a little bit of energy and time with you all. Mm -hmm. I think you're all absolutely amazing, um, and, you know, your souls, your mom come to shine through. Um, thank you for sharing the energy with us. Yeah, thank yes, you. Yes, we're all thinking of you. We're all thinking of you as well. Yeah. Yeah. I'm I'm going to pop off and I'm going to um drop um it, I think it's a good enough time to because I'm aware that the daughter of the lady currently surviving has got children so I thought I'll let her have a morning but I'm going to try and grab her um throughout the day so I'm going to drop off now and drop her a message because that's where my priority at the minute is going to yeah, go yeah, but I um, absolutely appreciate everybody thank you so much and I hope your day place is all good yeah thank have you, take care I know thank you I'll speak Bye. to you later. Yeah. I just jumped up to support Tink, so I'm going to drop down now as well. All right, oh. baby. Thank, All right, you, thank you, everyone. Hi, ladies. Thank I you. I just jumped Hi. up to support Tink, so I'm going to drop down now as well. All right, baby. Yeah. I've, ju Hi, I've jumped up to. I'm going to lose my head. I'm going to lose my head. Is someone echoing? Like I've just jumped up. Oh, We're in a tunnel. Eight, so I just wanted to say hello. Someone's echoing. You think you're echoing? You've heard I've just that. We're in a tunnel. Mute and unmute. It was Maddie. It was Maddie. Is that me? No, it was Maddie. Just oh my god. I was just watching that Delulu live. I swear to god, ladies, my What's she my, in there? My wire is short today. Mine. It is extremely short. Mine too. I mean I've just She's basically just saying that because you had tanks in the box that you should be letting her speak on her trauma and let, going over her story. You shouldn't you know be talking about her. I was trying to run an exposure on this guy. I know. Not what I was doing. Tink requested my box. I didn't know. I didn't follow her. She didn't follow me. 
Um, she's well, just coming to the box and You just wish that she went in your box because you want to do it for clout and you can't stand the fact Thank that you. there's actually people that actually care and it's not all about numbers and gifts. Yeah. You snot the difference is as well, like Tink, Tink's got in your box and you wasn't expecting it. But if Angie did hold this awareness on her own platform, her gifts would have been on and it would she would have already known that she was doing this. Yeah, if, yeah would I would have, have turned her them gifts on. on. Uh, that's oh, that's what she's saying as well. She's like, Alicia's sitting with her gifts on. So are you. If I knew that, so are you, um, Angie. If I knew that Tink and that were going to get in the box, I would have come on with my gifts off. I didn't because they didn't follow me. I didn't think that they were going to come into my life. It I'd doesn't matter. Sit. She sits with her gifts on all the time, yeah, and people were gifting Tinks. I would never sit and talk on something so sensitive and so yeah. to people with my gifts on on purpose. And she was questioned about her life that she had gifts in that, and she and all her minions were saying well you know it was the live was already happening well, you and then tell. it happened so it's not a double standard one rule for one one rule for the that other outfit she's, she's got in the box anyway so can please I, I, yeah, can, I, I, can I just say hello can okay, I just say hello part? and then I'll jump down I just wanted to say thank you for having me um I do go in Miss Baguette's box Mary's Alicia's in and out I don't talk very often in the boxes um I too am one of the DV survivors and for over 25 years now and I just wanted to say it's so lovely that everybody supports everybody but we've all got to be so cautious of what boxes we decide to sit in and tell our stories in because I just I see so many people and I think oh no they're about to I can feel it's coming they're about to, get to talk about something and I think you're in the totally wrong box this is going yeah. to just spun out of control. Well, we've seen her upset people when they've come and they've they've spoken on their trauma and she started saying to them she doesn't believe them or she wants yeah. proof or this, that and the other. We've all seen that happen and people are crying, you know. It is so sad and you just think, oh my God, the times I've been in comments and I've said, please come out the block box, please come out the box. And of course, people are talking, they're not reading, you know, and you think, oh my God, this is just gonna this is gonna be spread to this and spread to that and before you know it it's it's all their fault. Let's get the man in, it's nothing to do with the woman, it's but all her she's fault. She's messaged Ben and asked him if he wants to come onto her live. No. Absolutely no. disgusting. Because if no. I came on here and spoke about my past trauma and someone invited my perpetrator into a box, <laughs> I'd be fucking fuming. I'd be mortified. I'd be mortified. I'd That's be ringing the police. I don't know actually what I would be doing. I would be mortified. I, I would come off the app completely. Well, I've been said why my gifts are on. I didn't know Tink and Troy were going to get in my box. Stop asking me questions like that. I've already said twice. Oh. Listen, and she did loosely justifies it by saying, "Oh, it's like a court. Oh, it's wait. like a court. Yeah, Everyone's got, got a box. right to an opinion." No, she exactly. Make like racist it. pearl. She's going to help us. Yeah, and she she's, she's, not, she's not a person to be box. giving out advice either. I can't, Haley. Can't, can't turn them off. Can I just online. say something? First of all. Number one, she didn't know that they were coming in her box. Number two, who are you lot to tell her to turn off her gifts right now? Like, if it's I got could, nothing I would, to do with you lot. Th this live wasn't meant to happen. Go tell your master, Angie, to turn off her gifts because she's held about three lives already playing recording. So yeah. come out of here and go tell oh. her to turn off her gifts. What the she's fuck? just turned her comments off. I think she got the memo wrong. People were saying... Gifts, Angie, not comments. So that's it. Because I mean, she can't why... turn them off because she's had too much wine and she can't find the fucking button. She, that's why. She said, <laughs> she said that she was going to do this awareness live anyway. Okay, cool. Restart and come back with your gifts off because you ha you can't when you're on live. You cannot turn them off. It has to be when you before you start the live. So if she knew that she was going to do the awareness that she's allegedly doing, she should have restarted and turned her gifts off because no one can stop her from speaking on what she wants to speak on but she knew what she was doing. What she She's intentionally kept them on because she was spammed in her chat saying, if you're going to do it, you need to turn your gifts off because you're the one who's called everyone else out for that for weeks on end. But the so she's intentionally she... chosen to keep them on. Sorry. The trouble is she starts off maybe, let's discuss this problem, you know, whatever's happened. But within five minutes, that whole subject has changed into another subject. So nobody ever actually gets to speak what they really want to talk about. 
because I, she's overrided everybody I, with her opinion. Down. I didn't restart because I didn't know that Troy and Tink were going to come and get in the box. They were in the box already, okay? So shut your mouth. Someone's just said that she's going to do it at, at two o'clock with the gifts off. But if she does this with the gifts off, I just want anyone who might be watching it, please be watching it through the FYP or through a cam too. Don't go in there and give her a number. But make Please, sure everybody her, also... Make sure you watch her face. Yeah, be very careful. Please, she has got no interest in this. She hasn't got an interest in it at all. But watch her face. She'll be sat there on her other phone looking away. Yeah. She won't be listening. She won't be engaging. She'll be letting yeah, other people um, mm -hmm. manage it. I, I guarantee and isn't it, yeah, isn't exactly. it against the guidelines to tell people to go and well, mass guys, report sorry, everyone Just else? be very careful. Just be very careful in Angie's live as well because there's no support for like triggers or trauma dumping. And also with this whole subject, because I was watching a bit last night on Troy's, I actually had to come out and I'm quite like a strong gutted person like i've heard a lot over the years and i even had to come out because it was quite traumatic so please look after yourselves as well because when you come off the app that that's still going to be in your brain so yeah. be prepared there's a lot to take on so please numbers anybody you can speak to the please difference was with it. troy is troy was angry and he wanted to say something to ben it's completely different like angie's gone out of her way to message the guy to give him a platform to give his side of the story no. was angry with him and probably wanted to give him a piece of his mind you know so don't be so fucking ignorant yeah it's bad it's so bad but anyway i'm, I'm going to drop down back into the comments thanks for having me ladies and all stay safe like mary says and miss baguette you know be in deja vu, whatever you do, <laughs> don't comment, don't do anything. Just be careful and take care of yourselves. Bye. Thanks, Maddie. Bye. Did anyone else notice this morning that she didn't actually talk or refer to Tinks or about her welfare ill concern? It was all about her wanting to cause an issue um, and calling out Tori and and uh, Kenzino's mum. Not once for over like nearly 28 minutes did she even mention Morning. Yeah, that's what I was saying. The lady, the, it, we either say the lady, the victim, the person I'm concerned, nothing. Everything was totally about what they're entitled to do. That's concerning, that's alarming and that's dangerous. She don't care. Angie does not care. She's also told all her people to mass report all of us, anyone that gets in a box well, that talks out against her as well. It's fucking ridiculous. Like, it's a serious thing and I was so angry last night and so, like, just so angry over i know it's just an app but this is a real life thing that happens women are killed a woman is killed once every three days in the uk by a man and i know it's not just women that it happens to but i'm just speaking from what i've read up on a woman is unalived every three days you know and it's not a joke it's not something for angie to sit and speak on when she has completely mocked people that have been through dv and not and not believed them and even Chris this week, she was in a live and it was very serious. And the lady was pouring out a heart saying, I've just lost my dad seven days ago and saying all that she's been through. And Angie put her head up and went, huh, what'd you say? Oh, I wasn't even listening to a word you said. And yes. everyone was like, Sorry, Ooh. guys, I need to drop down soon. Can I just say as well, um, FYP recorders don't pick up on this part of the story. This is yeah, really is about tanks. Yeah, and her survival. Right. Don't be pushing this part of the story about the Ange and everything because that's what she wants. Please just keep it with the Tink's part and the exposure and all that sort of stuff. This is just irrelevant. Yeah, Do you know I what mean, I mean? Yeah, I agree, yeah. <laughs> because I didn't want to take away from it by being so, like I just left Troy's live last night. I said a couple of comments and I left because I didn't want to make it about people asking me why I was so angry in the comments that Angie was going to run a live on it. Because it's not about that. It's about what these women have been through, no. what this man has done and is like. Can someone Thanks do for me up though, love? I need to go, I need to go. I'm going for out for lunch. So I'll probably come back to about 20 different problems. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can you do a poll with But um, thanks, ladies. Bye. See you soon, Mary. Thanks for letting me join. I'm gonna drop down to I appreciate it. As I say, I did not go in there to incite her, but if it had that trigger that quickly, that's my concern. She has no self-control. It just mm -hmm. spiralled. It would have happened then, it would have happened later. It would have so been in a couple of days she'll be drunk, someone will say something about it and she'll be spouting hatred towards these women. Horton, you can get oh I missed him. Let me find this guy and block him. I can't stand this guy. 
Sorry. If you're incapable of empathy, you're incapable of holding awareness lives. All right, everyone take care. As I say, I'm, think, I'm sure we're all on the same thing, that we're all concerned for Tinks and all the other women involved, and that first and foremost is the most important thing about this whole issue. Yeah, 100%. Take care. Thanks very much for letting me up, Alicia. Later, Alicia, sorry. Bye, Sarah. It's Deminda, it's Horton, nineteen ninety-two. He won't speak Thank now, you guys. but I want him. I'm going to block. I'm going to block him on my other account, <laughs> on my other phone. Yeah, Angie's just yeah. Mm -mm. And if he goes live, that too, <laughs> it just goes to show. Yeah, now she's like. Now it, for her, it's like a competition. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like who's going to, how many views she's going to get and whatnot. Hang on, FYP, one sec, let me just block this guy. This is it as well. Like she's probably, she probably doesn't even want to do it. But the fact that she's being told that like her platform's not suitable to do it, that's probably the reason why she's going forward with it, just to kind of be um, um... like, what's the, what's the word, like defiant? Like she's she's been told that it's no good, so that's why Leave she's going to push forward with it. Yeah. Um, but I mean, just look at the caliber of people that she's got in her boxes at the minute. She's got Alfie. Uh, everyone knows about Alfie. She's got Racist Pearl. Um, she's got Life on the Edge. She's just she's the biggest. She I used to think she was quite nice, but she's in and out of here herself uh, in this live. But she's the biggest troublemaker ever. And for someone who like she claims that she, you know she attends like the BLM uh, protests, mm -hmm. things like that, that she's got a good moral compass, and yet she's aligned with probably I, I would arguably say one of the most problematic people on the entire app. And that that says a lot about your character if if that's where you where you choose to stand. That's true. I've had a lot to say about the and camp Gypsy Queen as well. As well. Didn't see her. Mm. Sorry, I'm just blocking people because I don't want Gypsy these. Queen is the biggest wrong and life on the edge block. Yeah, she must have reported me today, but TikTok. Remember when I was live this year? Yeah, like, TikTok gave me back my account. Good. Yeah, because that goes to show as well that it's mass reporting that's happening. Because you, when you get your account back nine times out of ten, it's because people are sat there reporting you. Yeah, I got my account back. Yeah, Jade, I want to do a poll, but I don't know the numbers. But I, I wasn't looking to do like a. I didn't know that this was going to happen. I just came live to rant. Anonymous, you always are. <laughs> yeah, please do, Jade. I wonder if you, I don't know if any of you read Comment Cafe, but like me and Sweet But Sour have, have been the recipient of a barrage of really awful messages from an anonymous account this morning um, saying that, I can't even, honestly, I can't even repeat this stuff because it's, you know, I'll probably get banned, but um, it's an account with Lays as the profile picture. I, I probably mm -hmm. blocked them because they're probably, you know, I think they're going around messaging people, but it's like it, you know it's obvious well you know the, the kind of places that this person is going to have come from um oh ziana's ziana is come to him but she's, she's on already the... blocked but she's going to be on some fake account oh she's not blocked hang on but she's going to be on a fake they use fake accounts angie's got a fake account called mary because she messaged me on it accidentally once crispy six is that who was sarah who aren't you from angie's live hi everyone block and as she's reporting back. Yeah, I've blocked her, but she'll have a fake account she'll be watching on. Yeah, and she'll be in here on her actual account. Oh, she's Anna, is Sarah Lou from... Um, Sarah Lou with the pink hearts, is she from Angie's? I don't know. I recognise that account. I'll have to have a look in my... Because you know what's funny? All these people are reporting back to Angie. And I know they're sitting listening now because I can see that they're sitting listening. I'm not saying anything bad about Angie, but you know all these same people that are sitting in their boxes have been in my inbox saying how bad Angie is, and yet they then sit in a box. I would post the, the uh, messages, to be honest. I wouldn't give them. And, and the day they, they think I'm stupid because they're saying what I'm saying and going back. So they're playing no, a game and think I don't know and I'm just feeding into the game I'm 
playing a better game than them because they don't think that I know what they're doing. They're just pathetic. They really are. Yeah, honestly, I just, I was so enraged. I feel a bit better now that I know that um, Tink's not going to bring it to that that platform because that platform is dangerous. The other day when I was in there and I said to Angie when she was talking on my children and I said, because you're not a mother, you're not going to understand like the feelings of rage you get when someone speaks on your kids. Um, she twisted it around in front of my very eyes to get all the comments saying to me and her saying to me, you're coming for women that can't have children. I'm a girl's girl. I support women 100% and I would never come for women who can't have children ever in my life. Sarah Cotton, you're a troll. So, yeah. Well, you would never do that. And that's why I felt... I saw, like, like, with my own eyes, the lies that were coming out of her mouth and the way she twists things and the people in there just go with anything she says. She could say, like, the sky is purple and everyone would fight to the death to yeah. prove that the sky was purple because Angie said it. Yeah, they yeah. wouldn't... None of these people right. in her comments and boxes would dare disagree with anything that she ever says. Yeah, that's why she don't like people like me because I go against what she says. That's why I felt so bad for you, Alicia, because a, a lot... When you went up and um, defended me, you've got so much shit for it. And I was saying to Top Girl, I just, like... It breaks my heart that you're just doing something nice and being and a good she, person. Um, she did trigger me the other day when she started going on about my mum, but then today she that she can send everyone in and say, suck your dead mum. It doesn't bother me at all, you know? And the only reason I went into Angie's is because the ignorance in there, I just like to make ignorant people look stupid. That's the only reason I would go into her live and... Um, yeah, keep me blocked, Angie. It's the best way or you'll be crying on live again, hun. I think some people, you don't even have to make them look stupid. I think some people, as soon as they open the mouth, they make themselves look stupid. Uh, what do you mean? Um, thanks, Substantial Banana. What do you mean, Mrs. C? She's definitely having a hard time with people um, coming at her in the comments because th those comments are on and off. Um, is it the bots though? It's both. The bots are all the bots are saying is Alicia is live. Like they're not He's even talking about your mother again, Alicia. Yeah, oh. she will talk about my mum. But you know what? Angie would not even be one percent of what my mother was ever. Okay, mm. ever in her life, she could never. And She's so, come back in it. Yeah, some people won't experience what you've had, Alicia. You see, with your mum, do you know what I mean? Some people aren't that. Lucky. Yeah, I um, she can talk about my mum all, all she likes. You know, it's it's not going to change the fact that my mum's not here, and it's not going to change the fact that Angie is never going to have that relationship with her mother. You know, can anonymous be unmuted because they've been? I was confused because it was like you're typing, but I think anonymous's main account has been muted. Are you sure it went in? Um, I thought they was on about in Angie's. I did as well. I did as well. Yeah, I thought the saying I've been muted in Angie's. I can't see him in the list, but it's just giving me like the same people when I'm scrolling down. Were you on like a five minute mute maybe? Because they need the doctor in the list, do they? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They've turned it into drama. Um, we wanted to hear from Tink about this man and what he's like and what he's about and what he's done. And we didn't want to hear it from a wrongen or on a wrongen's platform. Angie keeps saying my mother is still here. Yeah, but your mum hates you, which is crazy. My mum loved me. Literally, and that's the difference. That's the thing that she just cannot get to grips with, that she doesn't have any relationship with her mum. And her mum frequently tells her that she's got to move out because she's had enough of her. Um, and that is something that probably cuts her to the core. And that's why she's so evil and so mean, because she can't handle the fact that... I've just come to say one thing. Specifically, I can't find you in the list or I'll unmute you, sorry. Specifically to Angie. Angie, stop locking your mum in a cupboard so that you can go live and drink wine. 
Let your mum out. But do you know what? I don't even want to speak. Put your pH balance out and wash your mind. Right, I'm going. <laughs> I don't even want to speak back on because her mum ain't done nothing. Do you know what I mean? But like, just you know, you're never gonna have that relationship me and my mum had, and that's actually really sad. Can I just say something, Angie? Instead of you coming for people's dead parents, why don't you go to your mum and thank your mum for even being for still being here? Why don't you do that? Thank your mum. Pray that your mum is still here. Yeah. Thank God that your mother is still here. Because unfortunately, and not everyone has that luxury of their parents still being here. Leave the dead to rest. The tip of the tongue is very dangerous. You keep yeah. saying things, I'm telling you, karma is a bitch and God don't like ugly people. Leave the dead alone. Fuck, man. We've just left people's rest in peace. Yeah, like, say what you want about me. I don't give a shit. Um, we know you can't come for my looks and my hygiene because... Um, but just stop talking about my mum. It's weird. Why is Chain Reaction in her box? Is she? Yeah. You hear what she's saying, or oh, you lot don't want you. Sorry, you don't have to. Okay. I'm just a bit conscious of, of turning it up because um, the bands and stuff that have been happening. Oh, okay, of course, yeah. I'm recording it though on my other phone just because I record everything, just so if she ever. Miss Forget, I love you, you know. I love get the best man, honestly. <laughs> Hang on, I'll get her on and we'll listen to the hatred she's spouting. Just don't show visuals, Alicia. No, I won't. Gee, I hope you're well. Can I just ask? Yeah, can I ask Nanny a question in your uh, Nanny, box? Oh, this, yeah. uh, did you ever give um, your son that GoFundMe money in the end? From the post I saw, the messages I got, you didn't, so. Yeah, I did. No, oh, yeah. Well, the latest I saw is that you didn't. You talk about being nice to people and you was. When like, was that then? When did you get a message? Hey, that Nanny. It was in, in February. Well, it's now due. This happened last year. You talk about people being nice and all we said would be nice. I'm just asking the question. And I answered it. Okay. I don't know who a nanny is. It nanny? That's the type of people then. she has in her yeah, box. I'm just saying, you talk about being nice to people and they get thrown back, get thrown back in your face. Our community was nice to you and you threw that all back in our face. Silence. Oh. Crickets. Okay. See you later. Thank That's you. Oh, okay. All right then. All right then. I don't have a clue what's going on. I don't know. Did you do a GoFundMe, Nanny? Oh, listen, that's your business. We don't need to talk about that. Oh, it's, it's her business when it's uh, someone who's in her box. Imagine if we had done a GoFundMe and done that. Exactly. <laughs> She's going off in a bit and coming back on the podcast only. She left the box. I think that kind of answers the question. Have all the tea. Oh, gosh. I don't want to bring awareness to that. Hi, ladies. Can we actually keyword live? Let's, um, can we put that It's not going to work because they use different characters. Literally, she's so stupid. Can we put that in the thingy, Bob, guys? What the hell? Because they're using the, the letter, they're using yeah. the letters with the symbols. Yeah. Why don't you just go on to sub chat for a minute? No, who uh, big up the bots, mate. Big up the bots. You just hold your finger down on that letter. I feel like you know how to do them, Crypto Baby. Well, no, like, it's Alexa. Alexa does them. Oh, someone yeah. please teach me. Like, I will be the best at it, honestly. Mm. Let's try. I've already messaged us. He's going to come in. Who? Look, they're saying bots, stop, please. I, just, I was just going to say that, Alicia. So <laughs> people are commenting and asking the bots to stop. Oh, you? Doesn't have any drama. That's oh, really you know what? I have no words. That sums them all. Drama. The Satorium, the woman are talking. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. No, he hasn't. He hasn't. Oh, it's <laughs> great, Angie. Someone's just coming in. The so bot is not Crypto, is baby. Crazy. It's Alexa. Do you know what I mean? Sorry, he's experienced enough and he's educated. Yeah, yeah it's, it's not me, man. been doing over the last few yeah. years. 
It's Alexa, and you'll never find her. Alexa, slide in my DMs. <laughs> Because you know, um, my mommy, you know what you're gonna do is give me money. Because when I put on sub only, yeah, you're gonna go to go on sub only. We have all the cash, yes. So you have Alicia to. Alicia on top. Have you seen what the bots are saying now? Yeah, Alicia on there top. There we go. Okay. I please do um, Please do one about me. Just put it onto sub chat only, Ange, so they can watch. Yeah, you can't do that you can't do with your, Alexa, um, if you're listening, do one about Miss Baguette. Yeah, Troy's out in a lot of Romans on here as well. Yeah. Oh, so I just think what it is, I'm, he just doesn't want all this drama, do you know what I mean? He even went into the box and he was only in there. He wasn't Alexa, in there long. Oh. Is this crypto baby go live, guys? I bought him. 